Hi guys, welcome back to my channel. This is the intro, period. Hi, we are on the road again. On the road again. We both are mentally unwell. We were supposed to leave at 7 a.m. And now it's 7 p.m. Because I had a lot of shit to do and I'm really bad at time management. We have 1,336 miles left to go until we get to Montana because I am delivering the two kittens, Gemini and Taurine. Taurus are both going to Hope, if you guys don't know. And their names are staying the same, so stop asking me. <laughs> With that, if you guys don't know who Hope is, I don't either. I'm kidding. You don't hit it. me. Oh, I literally Jesus. just shut my eyes. <laughs> go follow her on Instagram at Aww. HK Camera Tits. <laughs> don't. Don't. HK Camera Face. But yeah, the kittens are in the back. I got the horses in the back. The car is packed with all this stuff that Hope bought when she was here because she's moving into a new place, so I will be helping her design her new home. Thank goodness. All right, we will see you guys in a little bit. We're going to drive safe. Over and out. Show me your balls. <laughs> you guys, this is my snack. My frozen grapes. It's look how so stunning they look. violent. Literally, it tastes like a warhead. It's citrus. There's citrus so much. Yeah, it. get a good shot. Pop it in. Mmm. Oh, full mm. power. So what I do, I freeze the grapes for 24 hours in a zippy. A zippy. And then they come out rock hard, and then I'll take a whole oh. lemon, squeeze it in, shake up the bag, Shake it. Put it into freeze for another 30 minutes and then I'd eat them. But right now I have eaten too many and I feel sick. Good and sick. I feel good, good and sick. sick. Are you crying a little bit? So you're gonna be helped by mommy? He's sweet. He is a, such a sweet boy though. He's curious. He wants to drive the car. He should drive us the rest of the way. He's like, oh. Oh. Is this an Audi? I, I love prefer. an Audi. Toy. Oh. Uh, he will literally crawl under my seat if I let him out of my sight. One hour later. How the hell did you get out? Taurus. Taurus, man. Come here. That's a man. Uh, oh my God, he sticks to everything. Oh, this. Baby, how did he get out? I don't know. I think he oh. unzipped it himself. He unzipped it with his claw. Oh no. <laughs> you got, first of all, I look so cracked out right now. Look at me, look. <laughs> Look, look at me. Uh, um, we really thought we were brave and we were gonna drive like seven hours today. I'm usually good, I can do seven to 10, but we're so tired from the past couple of days. Um, I've been shooting a brand new series that's launching on my channel. Um, also, why do I sound like uh, a robot? See you soon. Oh, so we decided we're gonna get married really in quick. Vegas real quick. For tax purposes. For tax purposes <laughs> only. So we gotta find a hotel. Oh, here, I mapped one. I really wanted to stay at the Cosmo or the Ritz, but Hope won't I let really me. I really wanted to stay at the Super 8 by Wyndham, Las Vegas North Strip, Fremont area because of my cats. Because we can't, <laughs> we can't stay anywhere nice because we have two pussies in a bag. <laughs> we got a bag of pussies. <laughs> All right, we'll see you guys in the hotel. I can't. Oh, man right here. Lock Look at him, he's dancing. This is absolutely a disaster. We have to lie down. What's that noise? He ran over a cone. <gasps> what? what is a cone? It's a cone. Where? Oh my god. Oh my god. No. <laughs> I'm not pulling it out. Hand it to me. It's literally a cone. Why do you scare acting like it's an animal? All right, update is we were approached by a drug dealer in the motel that we were staying at. So Hope had a panic attack which I did too. Uh, we locked the doors and we zipped our asses out of there and then we saw a accident and there was a body on the ground. So I'm calling it a day and we're going to the Four Seasons. <laughs> it's a lot. It's it's a lot. We're like, I'm obviously not making light of the situation and this is serious and that's awful what laugh we just saw. Laugh or cry, laugh or cry. <laughs> but this is so overstimulating. Being in Vegas, no one's wearing a face mask. I'm not taking a chance and staying at some crack den. Nothing wrong with a crack den. I love a crack den. <laughs> but not doing a But not tonight. now. Maybe in the middle of like the Midwest or something. A little cute motel. Not tonight. Not here. No. So there goes our travel budget. Spending one night. We'll see you in luxury. Oh, All right. We are inside. Home. This is your new home just for the night. They're in the litter box. Why are they hanging in the litter box? You're going to love it here. Just think they were just outside for the first time the other day. Now oh. they're the first time in Vegas. Hi. I sent you to Vegas with the bucket full of paper. 
and no up to made them for you. Mommy's cooked you dinner. She's been slaving over the kitchen for hours. I know, we don't like Vegas either. <laughs> In an ashtray, how glamour. They hate it when it's not running water. They're so glam on that bed. That's gorgeous. Hi buddy, it's your first night in Vegas. <gasps> Hi little girl. She's absolutely stunning. She belongs at the Cosmo. Mm-hmm. All right, we are safe and sound in Vegas. We had our masks on, of course. It was so shocking. There was literally no one wearing a mask outside of the hotel or at the Cosmo. I love staying here. It's super clean, super hygienic. Literally went through all the mandatory and not so mandatory rules just to make it a safe place for people. But the people here, the people that work here do. But the people here, it's crazy. They're just like running around drunk at the bar, at the slot machines, just so careless. It's bizarre. They're so selfish. I don't understand. We're definitely not in LA anymore. Toto, I have a feeling we're not in Kansas anymore. It was literally $140 to stay here. I think that's really affordable for the Cosmo in a nice hotel. Like this place is beautiful. What? The cats are looking out the big window at the They are? Look at them. Little Vegas cats. Oh, She's like, you. I want to see Britney. Anyways, I am going to call it night. I'll see you guys in the morning. I'm so tired today. It was such a, for so many reasons, it was such a mentally draining day. I'm going through it. How are you guys? Uh, all right. See you guys in the morning. Good morning, everyone. It is me and Taurus. It's the next day. Hi. He's a naughty boy. He stayed up all night. And then he tried to sleep the... Morning. Uh. The nipples are out, boy. Go to mommy. We are well rested. I'm still so tired though. My body is in so much physical pain from driving and this past week. I'm so tired, but we're gonna get on the road, get some Starbucks, and then drive a cool 500 miles today. Gorgeous. You guys, look at this gorgeous little chartreuse flower. It's actually weed. And I'm really into it. Look at this. Gorgeous, right on the highway. Hello everyone, it's a check-in. Yeah, I'm over being in the car because the cats are like not eating or drinking because of stress and they're just sleeping. So I'm going to chug on through to Montana and drive another seven hours this night but I really want to just get there, don't you? I'm worried about the cat. Hope is hiding right now because she doesn't I'm like how ugly. she looks. Very ugly. No, you're beautiful, you're pretty. I think it's never said that to me in my life. But the view is shocking, take a look. All right. Whoa, buddy. You better get off of there. Brave, 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 brave heart. Oh my goodness. That's a road trip, kid. You little road trip cat while your sister sits in the back. And he's been here just sitting and hanging and watching the clouds. He's very safe, you guys, don't worry. Oh, look who's finally eating and drinking. Boy and the girl. Good boy, Taurus. Haven't eaten or drank water or went to the bathroom in 24 hours because he was shook. We've stuck them into I'll another hotel. <laughs> you guys, it is 3 a.m. We drove, I'm just gonna say I drove, 1,100 miles today from Vegas to Montana, which was supposed to, we were supposed to stop. And I'm like, screw it, I can't. So I drank two large coffees. And I'm like, we gotta just, we gotta get to town because these cats aren't eating or drinking because it's like stressful on them, on their systems. And I was worried about it. So we just gunned it. I didn't get a ticket. This is the first road trip I've taken that I've never gone to take or got pulled over. We're staying in a hotel tonight because it's so late and then Hope signs for her new house tomorrow. Oh my god. Very excitable. And that's another reason why I'm here. A, I'm delivering the cats with my best friend and I'm gonna help her decorate her home. So I'll be here for about a week or so. My daughter. I'm your daddy. Oh, you love me. Come here. Hi, baby. You need to eat a little more. You didn't eat enough. Hi, baby. So cute. All right, um, well, I'm gonna take a shower and pass out because I'm so tired. My bones are cracked in half. My hip, I have the hips of an old German shepherd at this point. I'll see you guys in the morning.
is has found my cash and he's playing with it and this one is trying to eat my sneakers what is wrong with you cash cat stop that taurus <whistles> that's my cash excuse me why do you have my chanel wallet he's looking for it this is what you want he's already got up there Throw them ones on the throw the ones on the hose. You want to throw ones? Hey, take it to the bank. All right, guys. It is a few hours later. I only got like two hours of sleep because the cats were narc. Is it narcoleptic? No. Nocturnal. Nocturnal, and we're awake from 3 a.m. when we went to bed to till I woke up at seven, and then I was up. Once I'm up, I'm up. I'm not going back to bed. I just laid in bed, and they jumped on me. It was so annoying. I'm so tired, but I went for a nice run. It was beautiful. Went to some shops. It was cute. Got a coffee, and now we're just hanging out, doing a little work on our computers, and then we're gonna go check out Hope's new house. And not a mask in sight, may I add. All right, Goldie's gonna meet the cats. She wants me to get gold, that food, that cat food. Are you ready? Come on, look. Uh-oh. Goldie, look. <laughs> this is Gemini, and this is Taurus, your brother and your sister. She hey, says, uh-oh. Oh. Hi. Whoa! Oh. Oh. She's shook. She's really Not she's so long. Oh. Look, she's hiding oh, behind us. Oh, she's so scared of Gemini. <laughs> You're a nasty little girl, aren't you? Oh. Gang up. It's West Side Story. Tor is, Tor is sweet. They have all kinds of toys. Oh, he's sweet. He is sweet. Wow, he's curious. Tor is sweet. Okay, we're making progress. Look at his tail. Look at his tail. Look at his tail. Whoa. It's because he can't hug his body. spray like a boy does. Uh-oh. Oh, okay, now she's had enough. Now look, she's looking away. Come here, Goldie. Come with me. Go with me. Good morning. Oh. Children? Where are you? Oh. <laughs> oh. Hi. Why are you hiding? Oh, were you guys up all night again? You guys, I'm leaving. You don't want to say bye? Good morning, Gemini. Good morning, Taurus. You guys are at your forever home, what do you think? Oh my gosh, look how beautiful they are. I'm so happy they're together. Also, I'm here to let you guys know that Taurus is my gay son. Taurus, are you gay? Are you a sweet little gay boy? I think he is, he is the sweetest. Don't tell Gemini, but you're, you're my favorite. Gemini's a little naughty and a little nasty, but I think she'll grow out of that phase. So it's the next day, I got some much needed rest. I was so tired, I went to the chiropractor here in Montana. Uh, if you guys don't know, I've been coming to Montana since I was a little boy. My brother actually went to college here and Hope's family is from here and Hope was also my roommate in college. So the world just keeps bringing me here and it's so nice. Um, I like to come out here a couple weeks out of the year, sometimes in the winter and the fall. And now I got to bring the kittens to their forever home with help in her new house. But if you wanna follow the kittens and if you wanna follow Hope and keep up with their journey, their Instagram is down below and I'll pop it up here. And um, yeah, I hope you guys enjoyed this video. It was a fun little road trip. Uh, actually, honestly, it was hell. It was exhausting and I drove way too much and I'm very, very tired. But I'm excited to be here in Montana for another week or so. I'm gonna do some hiking, some swimming, some fishing, all that outdoor stuff to get out of my system. And then I'm heading back to LA because I'm working on a new project that I'm super excited about. I can't wait to share more about that in the next coming weeks but until then i still don't have an outro so yes this is the outro and make sure you're subscribed make sure you give this video a big like and comment something sweet down below and i will see you guys in the next one bye over now <laughs> i don't know what i was doing